These are meaningless. You either have a tall man or a short man. You can't have a tall short man. It's meaningless. So similarly, if you analyze, Almighty God does not require to eat. Human beings require to eat. Allah says in Surah Anam, chapter 6, verse number 14, Allah feeds everyone but does not require to be fed. Human beings, we require to sleep, we require rest. Almighty God requires no rest, no sleep. Allah says in Ayat al-Kursi, Surah Baqarah, chapter number 2, verse number 255, Allah la ilaha illa wa la la wa fi samawati wa fi that He is eternal. To Him belongs the heavens and the earth. No slumber can seize Him, nor does He require rest. In this way, if you analyze, if you ask a person that if Almighty God can do anything and everything, that means Almighty God can even tell a lie. But to tell a lie is ungodly. The moment God tells a lie, He sees it to be God. If I agree with your argument that Almighty God can do anything and everything, then Almighty God can even do injustice. But to do injustice is ungodly. Allah says in the Quran in Surah Nisa chapter 4 verse 40, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is never unjust in the least degree. The moment God does injustice, He ceases to be God. Almighty God, He cannot make a mistake. Allah says in the Quran in Surah Taha chapter number 20 verse number 52, that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala never makes a mistake. The moment God makes a mistake, He ceases to be God. So you can't have a God making a mistake because it's ungodly to make a mistake. So analyzing all these things, you cannot say God can do anything and everything. God can do anything what He wants to do. As Allah says in Surah Buru chapter number 85, verse number 16, Allah is the doer of all He intends. Whatever He intends, He can do. But He does not intend doing ungodly things, like telling a lie, like making a mistake, like being unjust, like making a story chicken out left. So all these things are meaningless. So we unfortunately fall in that trap of believing that Almighty God can do anything and everything. He can do anything and everything which He wishes. But God will only wish godly things. He will not wish ungodly things. Hope that answers the question.